Oh. Are you okay, babe? Yeah. I just tripped on this dog toy. Sorry. That's not supposed to be there. It's totally okay. I'm sure it must be hard putting all this stuff away. Yeah. This was Teddy's favorite toy. Oh, I'm sorry, Mom. Yeah, I still can't believe he's gone. I was hoping he wouldn't make it to my birthday, but <laughs> remember we used to dress him up in all those little party hats? Whoo! Okay! <laughs> well, enough of the sad talk. <laughs> this is supposed to be a cookout. Go have fun. <sighs> I know, I know. World's worst cornholer, I know. <laughs> Is cornholer even a real term? I don't know. <laughs> Here, let me help. I'm really bad at this, okay. I know. Pull your arm back, and boom. Yes, we did, you're the best man. Thank you. <laughs> uh, who wants burgers? Oh, uh, not quite done yet. That's okay, we can get their plates started. Come on, kids, food time. Just a second. Are you seeing this? Seeing what? Kayla and Mac. Oh, yeah, he just scored a point. Nice shot. <laughs> what? Come on, Sam, I'm serious. Something's going on between them. Oh, you think our daughter has a little crush? She better not. She's not allowed to date yet. Ah, it's probably just in your head, sweetheart. I wouldn't worry about it. I'm just saying, they're being a little too friendly. I mean, look, I think there's something going on there. Maybe you're right, I don't know. Uh... I'll break it up. Hey! Come on, burgers are done. Let's go. Nice of them to listen to you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> hey, it's actually kind of hot outside, so I was going to eat my food inside. All right, it's your time. Yeah, I think I'll go with you as well. Uh, actually, I'm hot too. I think um, I'll take my food inside with you guys. Yeah, I haven't even had time to think about it. Uh, sorry, Natasha, I, I have to call you back, okay? Perfect. Yeah, talk soon. Okay. Hey, someone's all dressed up. Yeah, I'll see you guys later. Okay. Have fun. Oh. Uh, where do you think you're going? To go hang out. Why? Hang out with? Does it matter? <laughs> yes, it matters. I don't want you going out looking like that. What are you talking about? This isn't that revealing. You're looking for attention in that outfit. You know you're not allowed to date until you're 18. But that's not fair. I mean, Henry has a girlfriend. He's older. He's 18. He's been dating Becca since they were 15, Mom. Well, it's, it's different for you, okay? Because you're a girl. Are you serious? Dad, can you say something? Yeah, say something about her dress. Uh. You know, I don't have time for this right now. I'm gonna get going, I'm really late. Late for what? Did she just walk out on me? I think she did. I can't believe her. I wonder what's gotten into her lately. I have no idea. You two don't think she's going to see a boy, do you? I don't know. What if she's going to see Mac? My friend Mac? Do you know if there's anything going on between the two of them? Maybe. Yeah, they were getting kind of cozy at the barbecue. See, I told you. Hey, any chance you want to go on a little trip for me? Uh... Yeah, I was, I was just gonna chill tonight, so um, I think... How about I make it worth your while? Excuse me. Spare some change? Spare some change, just trying to get... Trying to get home. <sighs> what is taking him so long? Oh, I knew it! Knew what? Kayla's seeing Mac. Huh? Oh, I guess you're right after all. So now what do we do? Come on, we're gonna confront them. <sighs> so we're just gonna watch from in here? Yeah, I don't wanna make a scene. Oh. Teddy on your screensaver, huh? Yeah, I thought about taking it down. I just can't get over Teddy. I know, honey, I'm sorry. Me too. No, no, I'm sorry. I, I know I've been talking a lot about him lately. No, it's all right. I mean, we just put him down last week. I don't blame you. 
He's family. <laughs> there. I'm gonna go confirm. No, no, is that a good idea? Absolutely. What else are we gonna do? Let our teenage daughter date? We don't know they're out on the date. They could just be hanging out as friends. How about this? How about we just watch them, see what they do next? And you can have some more secrets. This was so much fun. Yeah, I'm yeah. really glad we're doing this. No. Nope. I'm gonna confront them. Wait. She's texting me. She wants to know if we're home. What do I tell her? Tell her no and see what they do next. Oh, perfect. We're not home. So, should we go back to my place? Sounds good to me. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah, they're heading back to the house. Let's go to the car. You are of me, so figured he fell for the bait. While you were following us around, everyone else was setting up. Wait, you were in on this too? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we all helped. Um, I mean, why else do you think Mac would put his arm around Dayla? Yeah, I wondered about that part too. No, don't tell me. You too. Oh, I'm sorry, sweetheart. They told me about it this morning, and I wanted to tell you, but uh, it was just too good. I'm just still so lost. I mean, how did you know that I'd follow them? Mom, you were watching me like a hawk at the barbecue. I think I knew what you were thinking. So I figured if I wore a semi-reeling dress and left the house without telling you anything, you'd take the bait. Well, you could have done this in the kitchen while I was asleep. You didn't have to go through all this. Well, we kind of did because your birthday present wasn't arriving until this afternoon. Yeah, we didn't really know where else to keep it. Um, which is why we needed you out of the house. What do you mean? Well, we know how much you loved Teddy, so we figured we'd introduce you to a new little friend. Now, I know, of course, nobody could replace Teddy, but we hope this little guy gives you some happiness, too. You guys, I didn't think, I didn't think after Teddy that I would want to celebrate my birthday. But now I'm so glad I did. <laughs> Thank you so much for making this extra special for me. Hey there, little fella. Hi. <laughs> His name is Bear. First Teddy and then Bear. <laughs> I like it. Oh. You are so sweet. Aren't you the sweetest little thing? Come here. <clears throat> so, I know it's your birthday party and all, but... Can we just talk about how overprotective you've been? What? What are you talking about? No, I haven't. Uh, okay, okay. I'm sorry. You're right. That that was uh, that was excessive. But you have no idea how happy it makes me to know that you two aren't dating. You're not, are you? No, but I'd appreciate it if you trusted my judgment, Mom. I mean, I am old enough to make good decisions. Just wish you believed that. Ugh, fine, I'll, I'll try to trust you more, honey. I know you're responsible. Thanks. So you're not gonna get mad if I start dating? I'll try not to. Good, because even though I'm not dating Mac, I am dating Ian. What? For how long? Uh-uh, don't you just say. But are you gonna say something, Sam? Uh, uh, who wants cake? <laughs> You're lucky I don't throw that cake at you. Come here, bring it in. Mm. 
Oh, by the way, give me my $20 back. You're coming down, I'll be right there, I'm ready for Hey, get back here! <laughs> we should go to Disneyland tomorrow. Guys, I already told you, I don't want to do anything for my birthday this year, but thank you. Uh, come on, you always go all out for us. Yeah, remember the surprise party Austin threw for Jesse when he gave her like 20 gifts? It wasn't exactly a surprise party because I saw you in the parking lot. Yeah, yeah. That, that happened. Um, sorry, bro. I'm not, I'm not good with surprises, really. <laughs> hey, hey. It was still fun, though, right? Everybody felt yeah, great. Yeah. Everybody looked great. Jesse looked super cute that night. You think my sister is cute? Uh, um, and, uh, ha, ha. I meant her uh, outfit looked super cute, you know, because um, she was wearing that uh, velvety black dress and that she had the purple coat, right? Yeah. Um, oh, oh, don't even get me started on those boots. I mean, where do you even find those? That was four months ago. How do you remember what she was wearing? Um, it's late. Oh, yeah. Um, I think, yeah, I got to go do the thing. So I'm going to... Go, um... Wait, uh, did you park in the lot? No, um, I had to park a couple blocks away because there weren't any spots left. It's dark. You shouldn't go alone. I'll walk you. <laughs> yeah, okay, sure. You are gonna walk him? Guys are supposed to protect the girls. It's not the other way around. Please, I am a lot tougher than Ken. A bad guy would be more scared of me than him. She's got a point. Fine, just be quick. I'll be waiting. Relax, Austin. Sheesh, you don't always have to be so overprotective. I'm your older brother. Of course I do. I know what's best for you. Okay. <laughs> Let's go, Ken. Yep. Lady Drew. Later, Ken. Yep. I think my sister and Ken have something going on. Really? Hey, bro. No, that's... It's not possible, bro. It looks pretty obvious to me. I guess there's only one way to find out. And that is... You are going to spy on her. What? No, no way. Bro, look, I'm not, I'm not spying on Jessie. Because Jessie is 20 years old. I mean, she should be allowed to date. And it's kind of wrong to assume she's incapable of, of making, you know, the, the bet. I'll give you 100 bucks. Yeah, I, I'll get started tomorrow, bro. <laughs> We're going to dinner tonight, and I know it's gonna be special. <laughs> I wanna get him a nice gift. Have I told Austin? <laughs> yeah, right. You know how my brother is. He'd kill me if he found out. Can I help you find anything? Yeah. I'm trying to buy something for a guy. Oh, nice. Someone special, I take it? I guess you could say that. <laughs> well, I have something that may work right over here. Do you mind if I show one of these jackets? Great. What do you think of this? Oh, <laughs> I actually really like it. Mm hmm. Oh, do you have a medium? Oh, let me check. 
You weren't gonna buy this, were you? <clears throat> okay, thanks. <laughs> Here it is. I'll take it. Perfect. Dang. Drew? What are you doing here? Uh... It's open. <sighs> Sorry, my phone died. So, what happened? Um... She, she bought a men's jacket. <sighs> of course she did. It's probably for Ken. Anything else? Mm-hmm. Well? What was that? It sounded like a phone. Is Jesse here? No. But it sounded like it came from her room. No. No. Shh. What are you doing? You, you can't go in. Austin. <sighs> Those are tablet. Oh, don't, don't touch that. It, it probably has all her personal stuff on it. Precisely the point. Oh, would you look at that? Ken just texted her. I want to read it, but she probably has a pin. She must have disabled it. Uh, you, you should probably stop. I just, she wouldn't be happy about this. Why do you keep taking your side? Um, no, I'm not taking sides. I'm just saying, look, how would you feel if she went through your messages? I'm the older brother. It's different. All right, let's see what her and Ken have been talking about. So excited for tonight. It's gonna be epic. See you at Giuliani's at six, winky face. Wow, they're totally going on a date tonight. He even put a winky face in everything. No, I don't really think it's a, like a date. Either way, we're gonna find out. Cause guess who's gonna be there to confront them? No. Yes. All right, let's see what else they've been talking about. Jesse's home. Okay. Hide, hide, hide. Okay. Oh, just go. go. Wait, wait. You don't even know if anything's going on yet. Just... <laughs> Stop! What the heck? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Happy birthday, dear Austin. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Woo! Woo! <laughs> I am so confused. We got you. Yeah, we did. So you two aren't on a date? <laughs> no, no, not, not at all. Wait, but you walked him to his car. Yeah, to finalize your birthday plans, nothing else. But you, you even bought him a gift. Oh, you mean the one I got you? Yeah, we went to the store together to get your present. Happy birthday. <laughs> the jacket. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, but wait, how did you guys know I was gonna be here? You think I don't know you well enough by now? I left out the bait and you fell for it. Why else would I disable my pin? Yeah, we knew you'd probably get suspicious and then go through everything and follow us around. <laughs> or make Drew follow us around. You told them? No, he didn't. But we caught him spying on us at the store. Yeah, it was pretty obvious. <laughs> but we made him promise not to tell you anything and to just keep playing along. I mean, I would have told Drew sooner, but he doesn't know how to keep a secret. <laughs> Do you, Drew? 
No, yeah, you're right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, I'm still in shock. I can't believe you guys actually pulled this off. But um, hey, this cake is looking pretty good, so let's dig in, right? Yeah. <clears throat> Before you do that, do you have anything you want to say? Uh, yes, I'm glad that you two aren't dating. <laughs> Me too. Anything else? Uh, nope, that's it. Eat the cake. What about going through my tablet? Or, you know, paying Drew to spy on us? Okay. Maybe I was being a little too overprotective. I'm sorry. Thank you. So, you're gonna be okay with me dating? Austin. It's not gonna be easy, but I promise I will try my best. That's great. Because even though I'm not dating Ken. Thanks. I am dating Drew. What? No. I tried to tell you there's no way she could be dating Ken. You little... Stop. Girl. Before you do or say anything, remember what you just promised. I'm gonna... Austin! Show... What? You promised! You promised. Fine. Thank you. Now we can eat some cake. No. Uh, before we do that, why would you help me spy on Ken if you were dating her the whole time? <clears throat> well, that's just because I needed some money to get you a birthday present. So here you go. Oh. That's really cool. Money. Yeah, it's your hundred dollars. Well, almost. Happy birthday, man. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, babe. <laughs> babe? Um. Not in front of me. Don't do that. Take your arm off. Well, um, what about this? No, hey! Don't! <laughs> Drew! I told you! What are you? You're done! Stay right there. Nope. Stay right there. Don't move! Don't move! Hey babe, wanna grab some food? Why'd you hide your phone? <laughs> I didn't. I was talking to a client. Listen, I have to go meet them at the office. It's urgent. I'll be back later, okay? Chad, why are you wearing cologne? You never wear cologne. Are you sure you're meeting with the client? <laughs> why would I lie to you, Jenna? Look, I'm just going to the office. You have nothing to worry about. Besides, if we don't have trust, we don't have anything, right? Yeah, I guess you're right. Okay. I'll be back later. I love you, okay? <laughs> <laughs> well, I had a really good time tonight. Me too. Who's that? No one important. So, what are we gonna do now? I don't usually do this, but... How about we go back to my place? That sounds great. Have I told you how beautiful you are? Yeah, like 10 times already. Well, here's the 11th. You are so beautiful. Sorry about that. Now, where were we? Actually, just give me one second. I'll be right back. Okay. Jenna, what are you doing here? The better question is, what are you doing here? I thought you were at the office with your client. Uh, this is my client. We were just having a quick meeting. Chad, stop lying. I've known the truth all along. You see, lately you've been telling me that you're working late and meeting with clients. I kept giving you the benefit of the doubt, blindly trusting you until the other day. I saw your phone ringing on the bed. I picked it up to give it to you, 
only to find a Tinder notification come on. I was devastated. I couldn't believe you were on a dating app. So I asked my friend to create a profile and message you on Tinder to see how far you would take it and if you would actually cheat on me. So you see, Sarah isn't some random girl you match with on Tinder. She's my friend. She's your friend? I wasn't actually gonna do anything with her. I, I swear. Right. As someone once said, if we don't have trust, we don't have anything. I'm sorry, but it's over. Jenna, please, don't do this. You can go now. Uh, okay, what's with the paint cans? Don't tell me you're pulling another prank. Baby, I don't do pranks on YouTube anymore. Whatever it is, just leave me out of it. I have plans with the girls today at the plaza and I don't want you ruining them. Okay, for your information, this has nothing to do with you, okay? I'm helping Kyle paint his new apartment. Kyle has a new apartment. Isn't he married? Okay. Are you ready for a little bit of drama? Uh, oh my gosh, yes. I love gossip. What's going on? <sighs> now, on, on, on second thoughts, I, I shouldn't. It's, it's a little too personal. Oh, come on. You have to tell me now. All right, all right, all right, I just... So Kyle and Amber are getting divorced. Yeah, and she's keeping the house. What? Yeah. Why? You know, I, I, I've said too much already. I, I promised I wouldn't say anything. Um, since when do you keep other people's secrets from me? Well, I would love to stay and chit chat with you, but I have paint to go by, baby. You're really gonna leave me on a cliffhanger. You wanna hear more gossip? Why don't you watch TMZ? <laughs> Whatever, fine. Don't tell me, I don't even care. Oh. oh, hey babe, can you pass my wallet? I've been looking all over for that. My wallet. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Cool. Thank you, honey bunny. I love you. Yeah, I love you too. Mm, I don't know. That is a little suspicious. But should I talk to him about it? It's tricky. I mean, you don't want to jump to conclusions. Yeah, you're right. Last time I did that, it caused a lot of big arguments. Maybe, maybe it's work related. I thought he was unemployed. Well, he's a YouTuber now. Isn't that the same thing? <laughs> tomato, tomato, like... Kyle! Oh. Hey, Michelle. What a small world. Owen was just talking about you. He was? Yeah. Oh, man. So he probably told you, huh? Yeah, he did. I'm so sorry to hear about you and Amber. I'm sure it hasn't been easy. Yeah, it's been tough, but I'm slowly getting over it. No, honestly, I'm just upset I didn't end it sooner. Wow, so you ended things. Yeah. Michelle, I'm sure he doesn't want to talk about it. Oh, Luke, I'm so sorry. I don't mean to pry. Oh, no, 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 you're okay. You're okay. Um, it was me who ended things once I found out she cheated on me. Oh, my gosh. How did you find that out? Well, at first it was little clues that made me suspicious, you know? Like, I found gifts in the closet that were for other men, and... She smelled like cologne that wasn't even mine. And she just kept getting caught in her own lies. <sighs> That's awful. Yeah. And That's I right. tried not to make a big deal of it at first, but then I found a piece of evidence that was undeniable. Which was? A hotel key card in her purse. Yeah. And eventually I hired a personal investigator to track her. <laughs> but sure enough, he found her at a hotel with someone else. You poor thing. Yeah. And if it wasn't for John Kelsner, I may have stayed in denial. But luckily, he helped me discover the truth. Hey, I've always believed that it's better to be hurt by the truth 
than to be comforted by a lie. Exactly. Anyways, uh, I don't need his services anymore, but if any of you ladies do, I'd be happy to give it to you. Um, I'll, I'll take it. I have a friend who may need it. I see. Well, I highly recommend him. He's really good. Thanks, Kyle. Yeah. It was good to see you. Oh, also, if you ever need help painting your new apartment, I'm your girl. I painted our new bedroom last year. Uh, painting my place? Yeah, the new place you just got. I don't have a new place. I've got to go. I'll see you guys. <laughs> That's going to be so good. Yeah. Hey, sorry. I'm going Hey, honey bunny. Oh, sorry, I got the wet paint. Yeah. Uh, how was your day? Um, interesting. Is that perfume I smell? Oh, uh, no, 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 no. I, I used one of your fancy shampoos this morning. That's probably what you're smelling. Anyways, I am exhausted because we painted Kyle's entire apartment, literally every single wall. Is that so? Yeah. And you painted it pink. Yeah. You know, Kyle. <laughs> And it was exhausting because he is a terrible painter, so I pretty much had to do the whole thing. Anyways, baby, I'm, I'm pretty tired, so I think we're going to go to bed early tonight. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Hey, um, I found a key card in your wallet for a hotel room. Hotel room? That's really thick. You know what? Kyle was staying in a hotel when him and Amber first broke up. Yeah, I used to visit him sometimes, and I must have forgot about it. Oh, right, okay. So, Kyle moved out of the house, went into a hotel, and then moved into this new apartment. Yeah. Yeah, you trust me, don't you? Sure. I trust you, unless you've given me any reason not to. No. None at all. And I'm glad you do trust me. Because if we don't have trust, then we don't have any. I'm gonna get ready for bed. All right? All right. Sounds good. Hello? Hi, is this John? Yes, it is. How can I help you? Hi, um, um, it's about my husband. You must be Michelle. How'd you know it was me? Did you forget what it is I do for a living? <sighs> right. Sunglasses and hoodie, huh? You're making it seem like you're the one with something to hide. When it's your husband who's been sneaking around. I know. It just feels like I shouldn't be doing this. What do you mean? I trust my husband. I don't think he's capable of doing something like this. I mean, yeah, he may have his crazy moments with his crazy ideas, but he would never cheat on me. At least I don't think. Well, that's what I'm here to find out. And don't you worry. We're gonna get to the bottom of this. Now, how long have you two been married? Five years. Uh, actually, it'll be our six year anniversary next month. Well, we'll see if you make it to that. Now, you said your husband was hiding a hotel key in his wallet? Any other odd behavior lately? Well, he hasn't been himself lately. Plus, he lied to me about hanging out with his best friend, Kyle. Oh, and last night when I came home, he hung up the phone really fast and he smelled like perfume. Mm -hmm. Any unusual credit card transactions lately? Perhaps any missing gifts meant for you? Not that I know of. Mm. Even so, it's not sounding good so far. <sighs> yeah, I see a photo of him. Yes. Here you go. <laughs> he likes to play around. I can see that. Hopefully just in the photos. Send those to me. Okay. All right. Sent. So, <clears throat> how does this work exactly? Well, if you'd like to proceed, I'll start tailing him. I'll track where he goes, who he talks to, what he does. 
But that's only if you want to move forward with this investigation. Are you sure you'd like to continue? Is there any reason not to? Well, let's just say we find out he's done nothing wrong. And then he learns that you have hired a private investigator. That could damage your relationship. Huh. I didn't think about that, actually. Um, do you think maybe I should just, maybe I should just wait a little bit longer? Hold on. Is that your husband there? Oh my gosh, he's here! Did he follow you? No, no, I don't think so. It's just that we come here all the time. Um, looks like he's going to shop in that store. Does he usually buy clothes from that store? No, that's a women's fashion store. Interesting. He told me he was going to the gym today. Well, can you really believe anything he says anymore? What should we do now? I'll go after him. I assume this means I'm hired then? Yes. Yes, that, that's the one. Thank you so much. She's gonna love this. No problem. I really hope she does. Thank, Thank you. you. Bye. Have a nice day. What did you find out? Well, he's definitely buying a gift for someone in there. There was a name on the gift tag. Does your husband call you Sugar Bear? Oh, he calls me Honey Bunny. Hmm. Then he was definitely buying a gift for someone else then. Based on my professional opinion, it does not look good. We should follow him. Come on. What? Right now? Well, unless you prefer to wait until next week to find out if your husband's cheating on you, there's no time like the present. Let's go. I did not think my day was going to go like this. I feel like a spy. Yeah, it's kind of fun, right? Not when it's your own husband. Oh, sorry. What do you think he's doing? Looks like he's going on a date if you ask me. This can't be happening. No, it's happening, all right. <gasps> That's it, I'm going over there. Hey, wait, you storm over there right now. You blow our shot catching undeniable evidence. But what could be more undeniable than that? We need more proof, come here. So what are we doing now exactly? We're gonna spy on him from inside the theater. What? Trust me, you want to corner him, so there's no way he can weasel out of it. Okay. Excuse me. We're meeting a man and a woman that just walked in. Do you recall which movie they were going to see? Yeah, they're seeing the new Doctor Strange movie. Excellent. Well, take two. Wait, I don't know if I can do this anymore. I can't handle it. It's almost over. You can do this. By the way, would you like some popcorn? How can you think of popcorn at a time like this? I can barely see anything. Yeah, I was hoping for better seats. I can be able to watch the movie. The movie? I'm talking about Owen. Oh, right, right. <gasps> oh, my gosh. He just put his arm around her. If he goes in for the kiss, game over. The kiss? Uh, don't you think we've had enough already? I mean, this is ridiculous. Mm, I feel like it's getting pretty good. Are you serious right now? Sorry. <gasps> no, 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 this is gone. Excuse me. This has gone way too far. All right, thank you. Excuse me, you lying. What's going on? You're not my husband. Uh, you're right. Huh. 
Have we been following the wrong guy the whole time? That's impossible. I saw his face myself. I, we're... What's going on? What's happening? Oh my gosh. What is happening? Well, well, well. This is exactly the moment I've been waiting for. <laughs> you should see the look on your face. It's so funny. Oh, we got her so good, guys. <laughs> this is for you, honey bunny. But uh, I'm so confused. <laughs> Happy anniversary, my love. But our anniversary isn't for another few weeks. Oh, I know. <laughs> But if I did it near the day, you would totally catch on, you little smarty pants. <laughs> Wait, so this whole thing was a setup? Yep. If I may, my lady. You see, the paints. I use that to paint the signs. And I know how much you love gossip, so I knew you couldn't resist the story I made up about Kyle. <laughs> Sorry, don't be mad. He made me make up that whole thing. Oh, you wanted to do it, though. I know. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. So you're telling me you're not getting a divorce? Nope. Oh, and this guy is not a private investigator. You're not? No. Nope. Name's not even John. It's Eli. <laughs> and all that was left to do is to get you to follow me into the movie theater. Or should I say, my stunt double. Wow. <laughs> I mean... And where's the hat well? I can't believe I fell for all this. I mean, I, you went through all of that just to surprise me for our anniversary. Yep, and it doesn't hurt that I recorded the whole thing for an epic vlog. Oh, and you might want to check inside the box. Ooh, okay. John, Eli, please, can you just, whatever, your name's, okay. <sighs> Perfume. Yep. And I may or may not have spread that on me when you came home the other day. You're really something, you know that? <laughs> I love you so much, okay? And I could never cheat on you. Deep down, I knew that. I trust you with all my heart. Good. It makes me really happy because if we don't have trust... We don't have anything. Thank you, babe. Mm -hmm. Wow. Best anniversary ever. I mean, I am speechless. Oh, it's actually not done yet. The hotel key? Mm -hmm. Actually, that's our hotel key because I got us a room in... Vegas. Babe, you did it. Yep. You did it. Yep. Oh my gosh, Vegas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh we my... gotta go catch a flight right now or we're gonna miss it. Wait, 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 hold on, babe. I mean, isn't this too much? Like, can we afford all of this? Yeah. Why do you think I vlogged the whole thing? I bet the views from this video alone will pay for the whole thing. Wow. Come on. I'm gonna get you oh. back. Business has just been a little slow, that's all. I'm so sorry. People nowadays want to try something new and exciting. Unless you can get the cash together before we then. We have three days left before eviction. Old ways don't open new doors, Appa. I'll get us out of this situation myself. 